come on. Where are they? They were late. They were never this late. I haven't had any all day. <gasps> yes, they're back. Hey, where have you been? It's bad enough that you make me wait all day. Now you have the nerve to come in late and still make me wait. I want to hear how your day went, but first things first. Pull it out. You heard me. Pull. It. Out. Please don't make me beg. I've been thinking about you all day. I can't wait a second longer. Or would you rather I pull it out for you? You'll do it? Okay. There it is. It's more veiny than I remember, but it's been a while. What's wrong? Are you nervous? Well, don't be. This isn't the first time we've done this. I just want to suck it. Don't say it like that. What do you mean? Ugh, you naughty thing. You know what I mean. I'm talking about your arm. I want to suck your blood, you pervert. I can't bite through your sweater. That's why I ask you to take out your arm by rolling up your sleeve. You know I don't like the pre-packaged stuff they send us every week. It has like a bitter aftertaste. I'll definitely take it if there's nothing else, but I'd rather get it fresh from someone. The thing is, we're not allowed to just bite random people whenever we feel like. It's against the law for us. Besides, we're not like our ancestors. Modern vampires have modern standards. Consent is very important to us. That's why I'm happy that you agreed to share some of your blood with me. I was really nervous to ask you. Most people don't agree to share their blood with us. They believe that crazy rumor that they'll turn to a bat or a vampire. And even the few that do agree, they never share more than once. Some hate the feeling, while well, others just find it weird. So I'm really happy you agree to do this for me every few days. Let me just find a spot. Are you ready? I promise. It'll just be a small nibble. I don't want to hurt you. Okay, time to dig in. <clears throat> wow, that was worth the wait. Your blood really is delicious. Hmm? Did you say something? How did I know that your blood would be good? Our nose. We can judge the quality of someone's blood just by smelling them. Depending on the scent, that tells us whether someone's blood is merely okay or if it's really, really good. If you think about it, all us monster boys have different abilities with our noses. For example, dog boys can track someone based on where their scent is. That's why so many of them join search and rescue teams. But us vampires have to be careful. Otherwise, we could give in to our bloodlust. What's that? Well, it's when we can't control ourselves and force ourselves onto the closest victim. Don't worry, though. I am, uh... I'm perfectly... Perfectly... Hmm? What's wrong? Why are you looking at me like that? My, my face is red? And my eyes are glowing? Oh no. It's happening. Don't worry. I can control it. I can... I can... No. I can't. Your blood is irresistible. You're irresistible. Since you've kindly given me what you want, I think I need to return the favor. Lay down. Try not to squirm. 
I'll make sure you enjoy it too. What am I planning? <laughs> you were thinking about it earlier, right? I don't need to be a succubus to know what's on your mind. Just relax. I'll do all the work. Let me just pull it out. What am I going to grab? You know what. Are you nervous? Is this making your heart race? I'm too close. No. I think I'm not close enough. It's alright. It's only natural for you to be nervous when you have such a cute vampire roommate on top of you. Just breathe. Relax. I'm gonna take it out now. See? Your other arm is out now. And it tastes just as good. <laughs> really had you going there, didn't I? You probably thought you were getting lucky today. Hey, don't look so disappointed. But you see, I can control my bloodlust. You don't have to worry about me going crazy or something. I was in control the whole time. Yep, I meant every word I said. Hmm? Did I... Did I mean it when I said you were irresistible? I don't... No, I don't remember saying that. You, uh... You must be imagining things. I mean, a vampire and a human? That's... That's silly. Anyways, all that messing around has made me hungry. Are you hungry? Let me make it up for all the teasing. I'll pay for our food tonight. I'll just look at my phone and see what's available. What? No, I'm I'm not I'm not avoiding the question. I I just can't look at you right now because because I'm busy ordering dinner. So what are you craving? Tacos, burgers, pizza? Hey, I can't order if you block the phone with your hand like that. Okay. I'll, I'll look up at you. What, what do you want? You want me to be honest? Okay, I am actually craving pizza. <laughs> Sorry, I know that's not what you meant. I, I just wanted you to know how happy I am to have you here. I didn't know what to expect when I found out my roommate was going to be a human. Because you picked me, I, I thought for sure you'd be some weirdo or pervert. But you've been really kind to me these past few months. And I just want you to know that I don't see you as just a walking happy meal. I see you for who you are, and I care about you a lot. You're the nicest and kindest human I've ever met. That's probably why your blood tastes extra sweet. I don't know how long we'll be living together, but... If there's anything I can do for you, just say the word. If the teasing is too much, I'll stop if you want me to. You don't mind? I'm happy to hear that. I do enjoy teasing you every now and again. You always have the best reactions. Although, what if we stopped playing around? What would you do if I stopped teasing and started being serious? <laughs> See? I told you you had the best reactions. Your face has a nice pink glow to it now. Alright, alright. That's enough teasing for today. So, did you have any plans for tonight? No? Okay, then why don't we stay in and have dinner and a movie? You pick something to watch, and I'll go and order dinner. What do you want in the pizza? Garlic? Um, are you sure? Oh, I get it. Garlic, vampires, ha ha. Seriously though, you're okay with the usual? Got it. I'll give them a call, and they should be here in a little bit. Alright, 
Let me change into something more comfy. Don't start the movie yet. Wait for me.